All right, guys, so we're going to check out what's new at Harbor Freight. So, hey, there's the man himself right there. What's going on, dude? How you doing, Clay? Good. So, for you guys that may not know, this is the lawn, and uh, I seen the teaser on Instagram. Yep. We all had something covered up, and it looks like it was some, right here. Some people guessed Batmobile. Some people guessed, you had all sorts of guesses, but okay. we're launching a new uh, 5x10 trailer, okay. utility trailer. Uh, it'll be available in summer. Uh, and I have got Troy here who can tell you a little bit more about it. Okay, cool. Nice to meet you, Troy. Okay. Nice to meet you as well. The heart of this design is in the rail system. Okay. So there's twin rails that run all the way around the trailer. It does a couple things. One, it gives the trailer complete strength. You don't have to have this top rail for strength to carry your payload. Okay. So you can actually have it. But the other neat thing is all these accessories, they all bolt on. Okay. And once they bolt on, you can slide them anywhere you want. Tighten them back up. You can move them to the front. You can move them to the back. Very nice. And then this rail system's bolt on. The ramps, the jacks, all of these right. items they in the back are accessories. So these are all bolt on. Your, your, your ramps slide out. They fit into this finger system. So Very that's nice. what holds them on. So yeah, the beauty is you have this trailer, you, you put the rails on it if you need it. Next weekend, if you want to haul sheet goods or drywall, take some bolts off, remove the rails. You can foreclose from all different sides of the trail. So very nice. It's just very configurable. Very cool. My, my favorite part about the whole thing is the recessed taillights. Oh, yeah. Because every, every, them all. every time I lend a trailer to a buddy, Come broken back taillights, back. bad wiring. So. Well, it's always going to be the taillights. Or the wiring tore out from under it, or they forgot to raise the jack up and bend yeah. the jack right. Or the fenders. In, in, my, <laughs> in my case, it's usually all three, but here all the wiring runs in the in the rails, and it's yeah. all plug-and-play wiring. So. Well, speaking of lights, I noticed you've got some brand new ones over here. Yeah, these are our Road Chalk Edge lights, so it's a new brand under the Road Chalk line. Uh, they do have a uh, backlight. It's, it's a circuit that's wired separately, so it can be wired to running lights or turn signals if you'd okay. like. They also come with uh, amber covers or blackout covers so that you can run them on the road and keep it legal and covered. And then we also have a wiring kit that runs with it. Uh, they're also high-low, okay. so they can come on with just the, the bottom uh, or all four lights at the same time. Very nice. Very nice. So these will be available uh, in January. Awesome. Cool. So what else new have we got? Because I know you guys have always got something new, something hit up your sleeve. We got all sorts new. Last year we launched the off-road jack, and that's been a phenomenal seller. Sure. Uh, here, this is a winch we've had on the market for a few years now. We're just really showing the internals and what to, you know, giving you a little inside look as to what's inside your winch and how it all works. Okay. No secrets here. Well, what else is new and exciting would be uh, some power tools over here. Yeah. We've got uh, the new version of the Ultra Torque. Okay. It's got more power. Uh, this is in stores now. So what is the max breakaway on, this is a half, yeah, the this half. This is half inch, 1,500 foot pounds max breakaway. So y'all went up 100 foot pounds? It went up 100 foot pounds, okay. correct. That's awesome. And then this one, three quarters, okay. 1,650. 1,650, very nice. So that's, so. Not, that's not for your golf cart lug nuts, oh, that's yeah. for... It'll break things. <laughs> yeah, it, it does. That's what we like. I want my Ugga Dugga style, man. And if you need smaller Ugga Duggas, yep. we've got the uh, 3 8 and a half inch and the compact uh, impact wrenches as well. Sure. Those are nice. So I noticed you got a new kit over here. Yep. These uh, two different kits. We got the brushless uh, impact driver and drill driver. Okay. This is going to come with a 2 amp hour battery, charger, and tool for $97.99. $97, guys. But so five year warranty on the tool, three years on the battery and charger. So here's the way this works, and, and you can correct me if I'm wrong. You guys buy this tool, and you go out and you use it, and you abuse it. Yep. It fails for any reason within that first five years. You don't have to send it off. You don't have to mail it anywhere. You walk into your local Harbor Freight, you hand it to the associate, and yep. you walk out with a brand new tool. And you're back to work. Okay. You did say any reason, but you know, you drive over it with oh, a, yeah. with your truck or something. You know, there might be a couple exceptions. <laughs> Yes, so five year warranty in store. Any warranty the red company or the yellow company would offer under a five year, you guys would match it in store. 
Yeah, and you don't have to wait for shipping it back and paying for shipping as well. Guys, you can't beat that 97 bucks. If you're looking to get into another power tool line, I will personally stand behind the Hercules line. It's good stuff. We used it remodeling the house. We've used it in the shop. It's just really good tools. And you guys have seen the Torque Test channel. They put it up against the Milwaukee. Absolutely. And uh, it was really, really close and everything except for the price. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good pitch. Uh, this one we just launched as well. It's the Ultra Torque under Earthquake XT. Okay. Um, for those that are still choosing air tools. Hey, I love air tools. And I personally own a three quarter inch Earthquake. <laughs> And I've actually got two of the one-inch pneumatic harbor freight guns. So all you people that want to knock it, I don't care. It makes me no different. It works for me. It's cheap, and it works really well. So that, yeah. spend yeah. your money the way you want to spend it. I'll spend it the way I want to spend it. Right? <laughs> exactly. Uh, this one I just launched as well. Uh, Josh, can you tell us a little bit about the uh, fixture table here? Yeah. So we have our, little, our three by two fixture table. Comes with all the clamps you're going to need, all the V pads to keep things flat, keep them sure. square. Uh, basically, you can set things up as flat. You can raise them up. You can have the V pads underneath your round tube. Your spacers here to space up your flat tubing. Comes with work stops. Basically, set your work up so you got repeatable, you know, fixturing you can take over if you're making mass production. So you could use this as a tabletop or correct a standalone table. Correct. So. Yes, you can have it in tabletop mode. They're hidden behind the legs, but there is feet behind it. Basically, you would take your outer leg off. It would set it right on the table. The adjustable feet go back on the, the smaller legs. So if you guys have already got a welding table set up and you like the way that it's configured, right. you can add this on there for a whopping $169.99. Yeah. You'll spend that for jeeps anywhere else. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Josh. Cool. Got some new uh, paint sprayers. Uh, uh, launching three new airbrushes under the Black Widow line. And I got that airbrush compressor kit as well. Very nice. So, I can attest to this if you guys haven't seen that video where that one was put together against another name brand, Air Hammer. A little quick YouTube search will show that. So, it's pretty good. Uh, for Viking, we've got a new 1,000-peak uh, amp jump starter, lithium-ion batteries. I'm a fan. I've got this one here, and I use it. I love it. That's well worth the money. So. These, these are really durable, great for, like, repair shops. Um, you have a lot of vehicles to jump start, or tow truck businesses love this, especially the one with the 12 and 24 volt. Sure. So if you guys are looking to add a jump start, and you got to deal with... 350s, 450s, you know, zero maxes, whatever. Don't be scared of that box because it works. Absolutely. And we've got uh, for power tools, we mentioned before, uh, three quarter inch. Uh, this is 1650 foot pounds breakaway torque. Okay. There you go. Big truck guys. Five year warranty on the tool, three year on the battery. Can't be. And then I'd like Hallie to show you a couple of the new tools we've got on sure. Hercules. Yeah, we've got some new band saws for you guys. So we've got cordless and corded deep cut Hercules band saws, LED lights, quick change blades, and they're OSHA compliant um, with the, the pads on the back. In addition, we do have our band saw stand that's available. It's universal, so it fits with most major brands, deep cut band saws, and it converts to your tabletop as well as vertical positioning. Very nice. So a lot of people, they, you know, tools has got a kind of a funny thing, right? Like if it's an adjustable foam wrench, it's always a crescent wrench, right? Or if it's a slip joint plier, it's always a channel lock. So everybody knows those as porta bands, you know? Yeah. So, well that work with every manufacturer of that style? We did create it to be universal. There's multiple mounting plates so that you can use it with any major brand deep cut band stock. Sure. So I want to show you guys something real important right here. I want you to look at the price of this tool. So this will be the battery and this will be your cord. That is an extremely good price, especially if you price the name brand known version of it. Uh, a lot of people have been asking about the jigsaw. Uh, this is scheduled to be out in the spring of okay. 2024. And I'm actually really excited about the metal shears and the nibbler. Uh -huh. 
These are great for sheet metal guys. Uh, sure. Especially the portability of this. I know it's loud in here, guys, but this guy's been over here cleaning carpet for like an hour. <laughs> I think by the end of the week, we'll be uh, tired of hearing some steam cleaning. I might have to try something uh, to see how well they can repair their motor and their steam cleaner over there this week's over. Uh, this is another exciting one. Uh, it's already in stores, but it's our industrial bench grinder. Uh, instant startup, lots of power. So you're looking at a one horsepower motor on it, guys, and uh, 3,450 RPMs, yep. $179.99. So um, one thing I want to touch on real quick, too, is their battery platform that they have. Like, it works. It's really good batteries. If you guys have seen, there's one YouTuber. Um, the Dino Tools that took that apart and showed the sales inside. They're not cheap sales, so don't be scared of their batteries. They offer two and a half, a five, a four amp, extreme performance, eight amp, and a 12 amp extreme performance. Yeah, so, extreme performance of the 21700 batteries. Okay. So that's the difference. These are what, 18650s in here? Yep. And then the extremes are 21700. So it's pretty cool. And you guys can see the price. And if you think this is expensive, just look at what the red brand cost for a 12 amp hour battery, and you will see the value of that. Absolutely. I'm on the other side of the book here. So this is what everybody wants to see, is what's new in the toolbox world, because you guys are always coming up with something new for toolboxes. Yeah, absolutely. So, absolutely. I mean, this is just a new color that are showing a different color. Sure. We still have the same four, the, the black, red, blue, and green for Icon. Okay. This is always my favorite, oh, yeah. putting the refrigerator in. A lot of drawers and modularity in here. Very nice. I don't have the final number, but I think this full setup here that you're looking at is around 13,000, and okay. the tool truck competitor's about 60 okay. for this full setup. All right. So, I know we're gonna go this way and look at some tools real quick. Sure. And I know you guys are excited, but don't click off this video yet because we've got some really cool stuff over here that you guys are gonna wanna see. But one of the things I wanna show real quick is this right here, because if you take a look at this, and we're gonna tell you what this price is gonna be on this. Now I can tell you the tool truck equivalent of this tool it's over two grand. I think you add a zero to the end of our price right. and you get. So it's over $2,000 for this set. So this is the master ball joint uh, and U joint press set uh, under the Icon brand. Sure. These all uh, have the ball detents in, uh, in the tool. So as you assemble it together, you don't need you know, four hands to pull a ball joint out. Right. Uh, everything stays locked in place and just makes for an easier job. If you notice, they've got it notched out here, and this is made so you can put it in a blast, just like they have it here. You know, it's hard trying to clamp it in the I-beam construction part, because every vice jaw is a different width, so this makes it a whole lot easier. We've got uh, some magnetic tool mats coming out for a icon as well. So uh, we actually have one on the back side that's vertical, but this is great too, you know, putting it on the side of a lift. Sure. Um, probably not necessarily putting it on a hood, right. but uh, anywhere magnet, anywhere uh, steel. Also, small bits and pieces. It's very nice. I know what you're really excited about, so maybe we can go right to us. I am. I'm, I'm very excited because you guys, your social media team does a fantastic job Thank you. of bringing out the curiosity of everybody that's going to come by this booth. Because well, this was a big team. Everyone's seen it now that they're watching this video. But uh, purple has been absolutely phenomenal for us so far. We launched the purple Daytona, uh, Daytona Super Duty Floor Jack, mm -hmm. metallic purple. Uh, we launched the full bank. Now we're going to be having the side trays available, and we just launched uh, launching now the uh, five drawer in purple. So there's been some changes since this box came out, right? Yep. So, so it, what you'll notice um, on, on both of these boxes, purple and red, is we now have black hardware. Yep. Uh, black trim, black hardware, black wheels, the full blackout treatment. We also have full length drawer latches, like we have on the Series 3 line sure. of storage. For you guys that don't know what he's talking about, is there's the little thing here underneath it, we have to pull it over. On the, on the current models, you have to have, there's just one little spot on the right. side. 
So now you can grab from anywhere. And then we also have a power pass through port if you wanted to be running a power strip in here uh, and you know, connect it up to a power app. Very nice. So here's our full color lineup now. And I'll try to show as much as I can because these guys are getting really busy. So I'm going to have to. And over here, these color, these eight uh, full banks over here are all the colors that you can get are large storage. So okay. that's the full lineup. No purple plans yet, but if everyone sure. buys enough of the five drawer and full bank, it I'm going to jump over here and show the other colors that you guys offer on that. So here's the, the full bank storage system that they offer. Now they've got one other thing that's really cool and I'm going to show it. Actually, there's a couple of other things. we got a lot of things that are really so, cool. So it's, it's pretty cool. This is an exciting section over here. So, this is one of my favorites this year for a $99 price point. Uh, this is uh, a mobile service cart. So it's yep. adjustable height. Really easy to move around. You want to keep this pretty lightweight. This is a couple of screwdrivers on it that you're taking for a certain job. Sure. Um, but moving it around the shop it also has a, a drawer here. Very nice. So, 99 bucks, guys. If looking for an underhead cart. There you go. So, look at this. This is new. Yeah. We launched the Series 3 uh, 72 inch box at SEMA last year. Sure. 56s are in store now, but 27 and 42 are going to be available. 42 will be available mid November, and the 27 is going to be available mid December. Ooh. So, people have been asking, they are coming. The so side now you guys are can available. modularize and, and configure your boxes the way you want to. Like, if you got a small space, maybe you just need a, you know, a 40 inch box or so. And if you got a lot of room, maybe you want a 72 and a, what is it, a 27 or something like that. To One other thing to note as well, the 42, uh, we wanted to keep everything backwards compatible. Sure. So even though we're calling it a 42, it is backwards compatible with a 44. Okay. So if you have uh, either a 27, let's say you have the base tab and you want to add the top chest, it will still fit. Uh, it was a difference in measuring with handles or without handles. Sure. We just wanted to be consistent with Series 3 as we're moving forward. So 42 and 44 are interchangeable parts. Awesome. So if you guys have already got the whole one, you want to add a top chest, it'll work. No big deal. Yep. Same with the lockers and side chests as well. All right. So you guys have made some changes to your lockers. Let's talk about that in the new Series 3. Yeah. Uh, this is a great one to show you here. So the lockers are bigger now. They are 22 inches wide. Okay. They have a drawer on the bottom. Now they're wide enough to fit a refrigerator, a mini fridge. Very nice. And the drawers are uh, reversible, so you can put them on either side, however you'd like to set up your shop. It's very cool. Well, you guys are always killing it, coming up with something new and exciting, so. And if there's something you want to see that we didn't talk about here, Leave comment there. below, and uh, maybe we'll see Clay a little bit later in the week for a follow-up. Or, all you do is go over to their Instagram and say, hey, I want to look at this, because your guys, they're top notch. They'll, they'll stay on it. All right, dude. Thank well, you, thank you very much. <laughs> Good to see you, Clay. All right, guys. Like always, check out the stuff that Harbor Freight's got. If you're at SEMA, be sure to come by this booth because they are enormous here. Check them out because they always got something cool. Hit that thumbs up. Check them out for merchandise. Cool tools and discount codes down here. If you're not subscribed, click that button. See ya.